Hey everybody, we're here with tonight's item shop. Um, we're celebrating St. Patrick's Day with the Lucky Whoppers, apparently. We have Aura, which apparently counts as a St. Patty's Day skin because she got their newest style. Uh, sadly, Guild did not get the same treatment, but he does have a secondary style, at least. We have the Diamond Die Pickaxe, which looks really cool. You know, got two different colored sides. The Goldilock Back Bling and the Gold Chain Back Bling. Definitely recommend it for 200 V-Bucks. We have Wild Card, which I pretty much showed you guys yesterday, but I'll briefly go through. He has this lucky suit. So, technically, that counts for something. And a cuff case back bling. We have the Safe Cracker Glider, which... Same thing as the Glider and the Gun Wraps. I honestly didn't think they were going to stay, but they did. Uh, we have Haze, because she counts as a holiday-type skin now, because she got St. Patty's Day style, I think, last year. Same thing with the Ridgeback Wings. But uh, it's a really great skin. Honestly, I have the summer version. I didn't get this one, but, you know, hey, if it comes in a bundle at some point, maybe I'll get it. We have Star Shot, which, of course, comes with multiple styles. We have Chance with the Lush Edge back bling, and she's supposed to be a, a St. Patty's Day version of uh, Ruby, I guess. That's what it reminds me of, at least. Uh, and yes, I am wearing the Blue Egos uh skin i guess you want to call it i mean i saw it on his profile picture so this this one's for you honestly it's a great skin for 800 really we have the silver strikers uh one of the many bats pickaxe type things in this game we have Sergeant Green Clover. Not bad for 800. A lot of people may not like it, but, you know, she has a lot of color to her, a lot of detail. And you got to respect it just for that reason. We have the Pot of Gold Pickaxe. Now, this one's a fun one. Uh, I definitely recommend it. The Lucky Gun Wrap for 300. 100% recommend this one. It goes with a couple skins. Uh, third row, we have Taylor. With the back stitch back bling. And he his outfit is reactive to apparently eliminations, damage, health, and shields. So very extremely reactive. We have the respoke blade, which of course go with him. We have Blue Egos. He got his very own skin apparently, and it's in the shop, so you better get it before it leaves. Lucky Clover, which I think is the back bling? I don't know. But for 200 definitely recommend that one too. We have Lucky Rider. One of the more expensive ones. Same thing with Taylor. He has the Rainbow Clover. Back bling. Why is it Rainbow Clover? It's not rainbowed. Uh, who knows. But it has like a bullet hole in it. A lot of people say that he lost his luck. After that happened. But who knows. Maybe he still got it. You got the Emerald Smasher. Very cool. It really depicts his uh, very style. It almost looks like the like a motorcycle that he would ride, like with the headlights like that. We have Lucky Coins. Definitely recommend this one. Two hundred. We have Raining Doubloons, which I'm pretty sure is rare to this holiday. I don't think it ever comes out besides St. Patty's Day, but. Very fun one. We have a lot of them. We have, like, Make It Rain with the money, with the Monopoly money, and I think we have the pla Plantain version, too, where you shoot bananas. But, yeah, lots of renditions of that one. We have Wake Up. We have My World, which you could do with a friend. Rolly. And Last Forever, which you could also do with a friend. We have Orin, the brother of uh, Alexa, which is a Battle Pass skin, with the Mecha Fusion Jump Kit Back Bling, and the No Pick Pickaxe. 
we have Grimoire with her hooded or unhooded styles, along with the Hollow Skull back bling. We have the Forsaken Strike. And what else? The Daily, we have Burnout with the Wheelie Backling. Not sure if it's if this one's rare. I know he comes back once in a while, but not, not very common. Same thing with Xena here, which has two styles and the Tropical Stash Backling, which of course has Monopoly money in it. Uh, not a bad skin. Honestly, I don't know her full set. I don't even know if she has a set. But that's pretty cool. We have Sour Strikers. These ones are rare. They're starting to do this every day now. With the point you can pretty much tell what's rare and what's not. Same thing with the Neon Venom. I'm pretty sure this one's rare too. We have Socks. And Scanline. I'm not sure if this one's rare. But it does go with a specific skin. And it looks great with it. Um, Monarchs level up, Montclair, Ariana, Loser Fruit, Inkville Gang, and the crew. So, not bad. Almost the full daily shop is uh, rare. And then, you, of course, you got the holiday stuff. So, definitely get it before St. Patty's Day is over. Uh, it's, it's tomorrow, but, you know, gather what you can. Because it's not going to be back. I'll tell you what. You could save... Save your money on the Aura stuff, the Wild Card too, because he'll be around, and then Haze, because those three aren't really for the holiday, but they have holiday styles. So from Chance to Lucky Rider, I think that 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 whole thing you could choose from that. But other than that, hopefully you guys, of course, did enjoy this video, and as always, I'll see you guys tomorrow.